In this video, I'm going to show you how to embed a video in an email. Now, the truth is you can't really put an email in a video. Um, you can only link to a video, but there's a way to make it look like the video is in the newsletter. So here we are in Kajabi. We're going to go to marketing and then we're going to go to email campaigns. But before we do that, um, let's go to the actual video. So here I am in Vimeo and you could go wherever your video is and I'm on a Mac computer. So I'm going to click on the keyboard, command shift and four, the number four. And you see that gives me the little cross crosshair thing. And I am going to screenshot just this video section. I'm going to make sure to capture that play button and everything and let go. Okay. So I've got the screenshot. Whoops. Okay, so now let's go back over here to Kajabi and we'll create a new email broadcast. And it, this pretty much works the same for all the email service providers. Um, and let's see here, I just need a bl blank template. Or you know what, let's do one with a video in it. I'm pretty sure, here we go. So this template in Kajabi shows a video in it, okay? So we'll click get started and we'll say email with video test and delete click create. Okie dokie. Save and continue. All right. So here's our template. So essentially that's what Kajabi has us doing with this template is what I was going to show you how to do just from scratch. So we'll do both. We'll use the template and then, um, and then I'll show you how to do this from scratch. So I'm going to click launch email editor. And then if I click here, see what, see what's happening. They're asking me to choose a video thumbnail. So I'm going to select an image and I'm going to select that screenshot that we just took. And there it is. Okay. Voila. Click save. Okay. Now here's the thing. Um, well, Kajabi added this nice like play button right there. Okay. So when this goes out as an email, it's definitely going to look like the video is in the email. However, um, we, where we have to send them somewhere else to actually watch the video. So right here, we have the opportunity to choose a URL to go to a landing page, to a checkout page, or to download a file. You really don't ever want to ask somebody to have to download one of your videos. It's just, nope, you don't want anybody to have to eat up that much space in their computer. That's just annoying. Um, so what I would recommend is we're going to go back here. And we're going to go all the way back out. And really, you would do this first. I'm kind of doing these this in backward um, order. You would actually put the video first on a landing page, then do the screenshot, then do the, the email, okay? So um, let's go over here to Pages. And I am just going to click New Page. And I think there's an Ogilvy or something that is just like a real simple video page, or you could do it um, from scratch. We'll do this one because there's a video on it. Okay, so we'll click get started, press and delete, create. Thinking, thinking, here we go. Okay, now, come on, baby. All right. So let's go here and here we can actually choose our video. So we're going to upload a new file, choose a file, and I'm just going to go over here and search for MP4. So I can just do any, any old um, video just to get it up there. Okay. That didn't work. We find something else.
Of course, all these are kind of long. I'm trying to pick a short one. Okay, so my video uploaded, you could see it right there where I'm making that goofy face. And then again, we're going to select an image to be our main thumbnail. So I'll just pick that same one that we did before. Okay, so now the video is hosted on a, an independent standalone landing page. So I'm going to click Save. And there it is. And of course, you can brand this however ever you want to make it super simple. That's what I like with having just the video here, maybe a button on how to learn more about whatever it is that you're talking about. Um, so now let's just sort of quickly review. So we've got our video on the page. We've taken a screenshot. And now what we're going to do, let's go back to, um, let us go back to, email and we're going to do it again from scratch. So we're going to go to marketing and then we're going to go to email campaigns and we're going to click up to the right new email campaign, email broadcast, click continue. And I know that there is just a blank one down here. So we're just going to use the classic editor. Okay, save and continue after we choose our recipients. Okie dokie. Now here's the body of our email. So it's as simple as this. We're going to click the image button. We're going to choose a file. The file that we are going to choose is um, that screenshot, that thumbnail here. And there it is. Okay, so it looks like the email is, it looks like the video is embedded in the email. We're going to click on the picture and then we're going to click the link button. And right here where it says URL, we're going to put a link to whatever that landing page was. Okay, so I didn't save it, but we're going to pretend that we grabbed it. Okay, and then this is important where it says target, have it open in a new window. Click OK. So when they come over here to hit this play button, it's actually going to take them over to the landing page. I hope that was helpful. And let me know if you have any questions.